Yeah, kind of. <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, press the E button to open Pokedex. Oh, press the, I'm sorry, press the minus button to open the Pokedex on Rotom in a flash. Navigate to the Pokedex by pressing the X on the map. Okay. Yo, Yuna, what's up? Welcome on in. Hello, hello. How you doing, buddy? Pokedex app streaming early. I know I am. Hold on, let me see if my, um, my shut up button is working. It's not going to work, is it? God, I hate it. <laughs> Let me give a little shout out for our wonderful Yuna over here. My name is Yuna. Everybody, go check out Yuna. Yuna is a wonderful, wonderful being. Playing a little bit of Death Stranding recently. Battle or catch Pokemon to compile volumes in your Pokedex app. The fancier are the covers for the Pokemon you've caught. Wait, what? This is new. Open up the Pokedex uh, to view all the volumes you collected on a digital shelf. See the rewards you can get with the X button? This is new. Oh, look at this Pigo. <laughs> Press the plus button when looking at a Pokemon. Do it again. I, I will as soon as I have someone else to shout out. <laughs> Press the uh, plus button when looking at Pokemon you've registered in your Pokedex and check the Pokemon's habitat to learn more about where they uh, can be found. Okay, yeah, that's all pretty normal. But this, this like, magazine thing is new. Sprigatito details. You can, uh, you can like shout out the majority of your chatters. Oh, that's true. I could I got um I got a uh, Zerinx here. Hang on a minute here. Let me just uh do a little shout out for a little shout out for Zerinx. Zerinx is also a real internet animal, and uh, you got to go follow Zerinx. Check him out. Hey, Drip Pop, open your mouth. What do you got in there? It's a Zerinx. <laughs> Sweet scent given off by his body mesmerizes those around it. The scent grows stronger when the this Pokemon is in the sun. Ah, you motions. Cute. <laughs> uh, what's this thing about? Um... Oh, frick! I didn't want to close it. I want to. It said something about like doing, like filling out stuff, right? Details, habitat, back. Interesting. Yeah, I guess not. Is baby exposed from cute overload? It is pretty damn cute. I gotta say, Pokemon name redeem. Yeah, it's true. You can name a Pokemon. Not Chives though. Chives is uh, that is already named. Hmm. Well, okay, I don't I don't think I figured out how that works exactly, but you know, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Is Twitch Guru from the shoutouts? Oh, those are pretty good too. This one this one's like a little custom thing. Oh no, oh, my my face is in front of the map. Am I gonna have to like make a hot key to turn my face off? Oh man. If I need to like see something in the corner. Ooh, we might have to do that live on my stream deck. Oh, <laughs> Where was I supposed to go, by the way? Um, I'm supposed to be going... Oh, wait, wait what's X2? Oh, yeah, there's my profile and stuff. What about my map? Does it tell me where I'm supposed to go on my map? Handy Rotom Phone is a popular item used to the Paldea region. Adding apps gives trainers access to functions. Use the right... Oh, using the map app, you can find useful information. Move the cursor, right stick to vo rotate. Left stick magnifying glass. I feel like they should have probably... I should have done that earlier on. You could just slightly reposition yourself. I could, but like that would mess up all my redeems, like my antlers and the cheese throw. I, I'll probably just like do a quick on off just in case I need to see something in the corner here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Magnifying glass. Uh, select the location by pressing A and you can set it as your, oh, you can set it as your next destination. Uh, flying taxi service. Nice. Also, new antlers, by the way, speaking of which. It's pizza again! Holy crap! Double pizzas! I love it. Ripskies. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, let's just go inside. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to go inside. That seems like the most logical thing to do after fighting. Hmm. Fancy in here. I can't actually rotate further to the left. Interesting. Hello. Yeah, a lot of patchy Risu's in here, by the way. Did you, did you intend for this? <laughs> did you be careful on the way to school, Mr. Drip? Wait, this is not the school? Is this your house? No. No. It's over here. It's got some gibbles and some goobies. I love this. Is that a Greninja? It is, isn't it? I like that a little abstract art. I would hang that in my house. I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. Uh, that's my house up there. You got a Pokemans yet? I do. I got my little. I got Chives, my little. Uh, my little lad. Auto heal. 
automatically select items from your bag to use to heal Pokemon. Use the auto heal, highlight the Pokemon you want, and press the B button. They will heal up in the following order. Hmm. Interesting. I've never seen that before. Uh, where where do I see my Pokemons? Oh, they're a little bit over here. Hi. See, check it out. We got a little weed cat. Whoa! I can slide down hills? That's pretty badass. What is this? A potion! Love it. Can I, like, fall off a cliff somewhere? Nope. <laughs> I'm like, can I just jump off this ledge? I don't have any Pokeballs to um, rename them. Yeah. Not yet. Not yet. We, we, we just started. <laughs> Auto heal sounds like a hack, right? Ah, oh, thank you for the boots. You can jump off them. Just This stops you the first time. Oh! Well then. <laughs> Let's try jumping off. Ha! Huh. Now oh, there we go. Yeah, see, it does work. I'm just going to grab a couple of these items laying around. Another potion. Ooh! I can, I can zoom out my camera. I like that. Um, is this not the school, by the way? It's a little small for a school, isn't it? This is probably his house. I'm supposed to be leaving, right? Oh, here we go. Yeah, I was just supposed to be leaving. Oh, trip. I hear that Nimona will be taking you to school. Oh, so this definitely is not the school. That's right, ma'am. Leave it to me. So you've already managed to make a friend. Well, let's not get presumptuous now, Mom. Aldi Pokemon is best Pokemon? And I read about all the wonderful teachers you'll be ha that'll be looking after you at the school, plus so many handy facilities you can use as much as you like. Add in your new friend, Amona. It sounds like your school life is shaping up to be fantastic. Don't don't judge me, Mom. I'm gonna have an awful time just in spite of you. Now you'll be staying in the school dorms, and I pro so I want you to promise me you'll eat proper meals. I'm not. I'm gonna eat Subway every day. Here's a bit of spending money to start off with. I also packed your lunch for the first day. Is is it a Subway sandwich? It is a Subway sandwich! <laughs> I love it! Put the sandwich from your mom in the bag's key pocket. I'm not I'm not bald. What are you talking about? I'm not bald. I, I do have cheese on my head, though. Thank you. Thank you for the cheese. A dish made by sandwiching vegetables, meat, and other ingredients between two pieces of bread. Oh, no. Are we, are we going to start the, the sandwich debacle in Pokemon? What is the definition of a sandwich? Is a taco a sandwich? Is a hot dog a sandwich? Is a choco taco a sandwich? The world may never know. But we're going to have the discourse. Oh, and maybe you'd like to take these two. Five potions, thank you. Some some ibuprofen for my Pokemon, thank you. For all Sammies. All quality Sammies. Thank you for the antlers, by the way. Oh my gosh. It's it's Wuffles the Wafflers Waffles. Waffles the Woofler. Amazing. <laughs> Hi, chef here. Balin's a chef? Are you actually? A hot dog is technically a sandwich. There you go. Uh, use them on those precious little partners of yours. Should they get hurt in battle? I know that every day of new life is going to be full of exciting experiences far from home. Just try to savor them. The good times, the hard times too. But if you ever want to come back home, know your bed is always ready for you. Makes sense. I'm from Belgium. Waffles for you? Yes! Thank you. Thank you for the Belgian waffles. Also, Scotty the Adi, holy crap, welcome in! Is my is my shout-out button working yet? It's trying. It's thinking? It's considering? No, it's not. Oh, yes it is. Scotty. Boom. There we go. Everybody check out Scotty the Adi. He's a wonderful bean. <laughs> Your mother's so nice, Drip. Did I ever shout you not? I shouted out you not. Yeah, I did. Oh, but I was gonna teach you how to catch Pokemon. Come on, vamos. Yes, thanks for that. You know what, Scotty? Thank you for being here. Thank you for being an amazing bean. This way. Let's go. Scotty, have you uh, have you started your Pokemon Pokemon game yet? Can I not move? Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I love it. You can do a little running slide. Oh, that's badass. Is this the guy who says that technology is amazing? The power of science. Power of Science is amazing. You can connect with friends and head out on adventures together all four of you at the same time. I love how every game has a dude who's like, wow, science is amazing. <laughs> That's good stuff. That's a good throwback. Mm, Poco Path. That means, like, kind of path. W where is this game, like, based out of? It's given me, like... Like, our mom is British, but everybody else is... Like, other people are using Spanish, and... We've got pumpkins growing in the same area as palm trees. I don't freaking know where this place is at. <laughs> Here's Poco Path. 
I could also just be reading into Poco Path too much. Just found a shiny. Yo, that's amazing. Oh my gosh, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a ch chonker. It's a, what was that? Is that like a bug with a ball on him? I have not seen any of these, by the way. It's Spain Mediterranean. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Also, welcome in Drake Blaze. Let me, let me give a little shout out for Drake Blaze too. You know, while, while we're at it. Uh, out here, things are different than in town. You'll see wild Pokemon out and about. They'll be on the path in the grasses and such. Drake Blaze is another one of our, our lovely real internet animals. Go give him a follow for sure. You'll see wild Pokemon and such, and they'll be on the path in the grass and such. Hello? Get too close to one, you'll have to battle, but you've got Sprigatito for that, right? And if you want to try and catch Pokemon, you got to use good old Pokeball. I got a ton. I have a few. <laughs> got some Pokeballs. Love it. Anywho, time to head out for work, Bale, and have a wonderful day at work. Thank you for dropping by. You know what? I was bald for a second there. So you know what? I, I can't I can't dispute that one. You got me. You got me good. Pokeball device for catching wild Pokemon. It's thrown like a ball at a Pokemon. Hence the name, comfortably encapsulating its targets. Hello! Oink, oink. Oink, oink, motherfucker, let's go. What luck! Time for some learning by doing. Try battling LeChonk! I don't know if I want to battle LeChonk. He looks like he's uh, a little angry. He looks- he's large! You try to catch a wild Pokemon by pressing X. When you're having a hard time catching, try dealing some damage. Yeah, yeah, I, I know how Pokemon works, game. Don't infantilize me. Uh, let's just bap him a little bit. Check this out. The Chonk. The Chonk is in the house. He's wagging his butt at me. The Chonk is literally just shaking his ass. Don't, don't kill him. Don't kill him. You're fine. Don't attack me. Very rude. Um, I, it says hit X to do, uh, right? Yeah, there we go. We got a shortcut key. I love it. Honestly, I'm already liking the uh, little quality of life improvements for this game. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Got him. Gotcha. LeChonk has been caught. Oh, adorable. Come on back in. Okay. So how's this work? We're, we like go back into open world. Oh, registered. LeChonk's data has been added to the Pokedex. This Pokemon spurns all but the finest foods. Its body gives off an herb-like scent that bug Pokemon detest. I absolutely will give you a name. You're going to be Truffle. Because you're a pig. And I name all my Pokemon after food, basically. <laughs> truffle. Chonky boy. And he also looks like a truffle. Oh, look at him. He goes on the shelf. He looks like a baby pig filled with helium. <laughs> he does a little bit, doesn't he? <laughs> oh my gosh, is that a boop incoming? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Hello, that was amazing. You got caught your very first Pokemon you went for. I'm crummy when it comes to actually catching Pokemon. Maybe you should give me tips. Anyway, have some more Pokeballs just in case. Not every catch works out. How many are you giving me? Ten Pokeballs. I feel like everybody who's like goes to this school, their parents are rich. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dark Matter, what's up? I got a Truffle Pig, I know, right? It's pretty good. Pretty good stuff. Put your Pokeballs in your Pokeball pocket. Pocket specifically for Pokeballs. Kuzco's Pokeballs. The Pokeballs chosen specifically for Kuzco. Those Pokeballs. We can the Pokemon throw a Pokeball at it. Remember, you'll be fine. You know, it's probably accumulated a bunch. Yeah, probably. Well, no, no. She probably has, like, lost a bunch because she's, like, shit at catching Pokemon. She's probably just, like, hucking Pokeballs at rocks, being like, ah, it didn't work. Now go battle those wild Pokemon and catch some of them. Why do you get leggings under your short shorts? Why can't I have leggings? Let's meet back up at that lighthouse over there. You can see our school from the top. Why are you so mean to her? I'm not mean to her. This is her self-admission. <laughs> Okay, maybe I'm a little bit mean to her. I'll be nicer. <laughs> the Pokemon you see wandering in tall grass or wild Pokemon run into them. Battle begins. You can start a battle by looking towards a wild Pokemon, throwing your Pokeball at it. This will uh, try this tactic to battle Pokemon in trees or in the sky. You know what? I zoned out there. What do I push? I use... Uh, um, oh, frick. Oh, that's adorable. Hey, where are you going? Chives, where are you going? Hey, Chives. Don't don't run it again, her. Are you going up a cliff? You can't, Chives, you can't run up that cliff. Did you just find a Pokeball? Is that like one of the Pokeballs that Nimona threw and missed? Oh. 
<laughs> come here, please. Pneumonia, please. Wait, 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 come back. How, how'd you get over there? Come, come back. Can, thank you. No! Okay, whatever, it's fine. Oh, no, th it picked up this Pokeball. Interesting. R is to make it fight things on its own. Oh, okay. Hey, can you go get that thing over there? Oh, it does work. Nice. All right, what is this thing? I've never seen this before. What are you? Hello. Are you a spider? That's a bold move, putting a spider on Route 1. You know, like, turn off, like, all of the, uh... You know, turn off all the people who have, like, a little bit of an arachnophobia. It is kind of cute, though. It's like a ball of yarn, I guess. It's a... Taroantula. Tar... Tar... Tarantula? Is that what it's supposed to be? Is that a new game to play? Yeah, what do you play, Nace? I like to hear about it. Oh my God, let's see. It's probably going to like, not do a lot of damage because of type resistance. Yeah, we'll go with Scratch instead. A string shot. Oh, I see some hoppips over there. Oh, some hoppips. Uh, okay, let me just like scratch you a little bit. Someone with a major arachnophobia? It's kind of cute. Okay, that's good. That's good. I feel like most Pokemon games do a pretty good job about making their spiders cute. There's only, like, one spider that actually looks like a spooter. Okay. I'm, I'm getting my controls down. Pokeball, let's go. You're coming with me. Also, I can't help but notice that, um... These Pokemon battles, you can actually see the rest of the world going on in the background, which is kind of cool. Oh, ho. level up. And I learned Bite! Ha, oh, yeah, bitey time. Uh, let's see. A Tarantula. Tarantula. I'm not bald, you're bald. Guess what, you're bald. Uh, the thread it secretes from its rear is as strong as wire, and the secret behind its thread strength is a topic of ongoing discussion. Uh, do I want to give you a name? Um, yeah, you get to be string cheese. You get to be a string cheese, probably. Um, what, what are those called? <gasps> Yo, I got Taco Fox's taco. Check it out. <laughs> Green ball Pokemon. What is that like? Oh, my God. Does anybody remember that uh, movie? What was it called? It's the one where, like, the two brothers inherit a house by um, Charles Lou LaRoe. And uh, there's a mouse in it, and the ma it's basically Home Alone, but the, the kid is a mouse, and the mouse just fucks up the house. God, what was that movie called? It was called, uh... Frick, I can't remember. But it, at the end of the movie, they make uh, they make string made of cheese. Stuart Little, no. <laughs> Not Stuart Little. Oh my gosh. You get to be uh, Gouda. You get to be Gouda. Mouse Hunt, thank you! Oh, Faison, thank you. I was gonna, I was gonna bug me for a minute. <laughs> Mouse Hunt, that's it, that's it. Oh, Zarin got it at the same time, too. Thank you, thank you both. <laughs> Scotty was close. Gouda has been added to the party. It's kind of cute. It's kind of cute. God, I couldn't remember the name at first. Maybe made me so mad because I adored that movie. It's a good movie, right? Be fun. I got a, po uh, I got a potion... There's a lot of Lechonks here. I don't really need these Lechonks, though. Oh my god, do they live in a tree? Look at that. He's just vibing in a tree up there. Hold on, I'm gonna get a little, little bit of a closer shot of him. Aw, he's kind of cute. The ending was solid gold. I totally agree. When they make that, like, cheese spring ball, I was like, I want that. I want that in my life. I, these Lechonks are just like, they love me. Look at them, look at them. They're just, like, vibing around. All right, let's grab some of these goodies. Oh, really? I can't get up there? I'll tell you what, I bet uh, I bet my Pokemon can. There you go, see? Sprigatito, thank you. Uh, I bet you I have to use Sprigatito for this, too. No, no, I can actually get it myself. And a revive. What do you think revives are, like, you'll like? I think they're, like, made of glass. Wait, what is that? Is that a hop -ip? I want a hop it. Give me a hop it. I hit 20 followers, do you think I should do a one-hour stream? Absolutely. 
I just realized like most of the Pokemon on this route are resistant to my uh, my starter. <laughs> Hop it flinched. Ha, oh, jerk. Guess what? Now you're in trouble. Now you're mine. Come here, baby. Is it is that Pokemon Pokeball floating in midair? It looks kind of like it's floating in midair. I was fighting him on a slope, so that's fine. I love the little like line heavy art that you see on the margin there. You know what I'm talking about? Like on the on the left hand side where you have like the it's showing like what your Pokemon are. I really like that. Outside of cold regions, Hoppet can be found practically everywhere. It's because the wind carries the species all over the world. Adorable. All right, we're gonna name you Cabbage. Good old Cabbage. Come here, Cabbage. Oh, oh, I love it. Uh, let's see. These guys, are, they're just vibing. They're just watching me. Can I get up there, by the way? I don't think I can. Can I? Oh, frick. Uh, I want that item up there, but I don't think I can grab it. Let's see. I see more items over here. You can go grab that. You can grab that for me. Thank you. Thank you. If you get a widget, could you name it Dag? A Wiglet? Oh, the, 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 uh, I know exactly what you're talking about, too. Absolutely. Absolutely. You, you absolutely got it. <laughs> um, I kind of want one of these little, um, what are they called? Fletchlings? Fletchling, Fletchlinder, Fletch, 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 Fletchlinger, Fletchling. Yeah, that was right. You think I can catch this guy at half HP? Probably. He's like level two. Because I'm not gonna, he's not gonna survive another bite. We're absolutely gonna name the Wiglet after Dag. That's amazing. I love that idea. <laughs> oh man. Fletchling was caught. It, it, it definitely is floating in midair. I guess that makes sense. It's a it's a it's a bird Pokemon. We got a Fletchling or feather a Fletchling feather? Fletching have been found in both rural and urban areas. Once a huge territorial dispute with a squawkabilly. Lights broke out all over town. Hmm. Okay. You're going to be Pepidou. Uh, wait a minute. Is it Pep Pepidou or Pepidou? I... Oh, it's E-W. That's right. There we go. I was trying to remember how to spell it. <laughs> Turf Wars, exactly. A few dragon types now. Yo, dragon types? Love that. I think my favorite type of Pokemon is ghost types. And there's like a few cool ghost types in this game that I've heard about. I've been avoiding spoilers like the plague, but um, but I've seen like the official materials that have been released. Oh, check it out. We can see the uh, we can see the battle arena from down here. Great, three or four people did yesterday, but uh, someone told me not to do that because it makes people think I'm only doing it for followers. Yeah, because I support me, and hopefully uh, people watch the stream. Yeah, there you go. Who are you? Oh, that's uh, that's one of those weird little guys that the professor threw out the start. I'm going to fight you. Let's fight. What are you? I can't even tell what you are. First person I've seen playing Violet? Yo! It makes me feel strong. <laughs> oh wait, no, that's just the that's just the antlers. Thank you, thank you, Ace. Mm, it's a palmy. That, oh, you you like this? You like this? You like what you see? I thought you might. <laughs> All right, let's get palmy beat up. What what kind of Pokemon are you, by the way? Oh, Thundershock. Oh yes, Mister Peter. Ob obviously. <laughs> oh, everybody loves it. Everybody freaking loves it. I can't tell what Palmy is. Is it like a monkey? It looks kind of like a monkey. Come on. Let's see what we got. I want to get a little bit more information about this lad. Of the arms. Uh, thank you. I've been working out. I, I do... Every morning I wake up and I do uh, 12 antler ups. First thing in the morning. Palmy's data has been added. It's a mouse Pokemon. Okay, it is. It is Pikachu. Okay, cool. Uh, the pads of its paws are electricity discharging organs. Palmy fires electricity from its four paws while standing unsteadily on its hind legs. Wait, is it a like a like a wah? 
like a, like a red panda. <laughs> the little mouse hamster thing buff and beefy antlers. Thank you, Buffy. Thank you, Buffy. I do uh, 30 wing ups. You must be pretty buff then, too. All right, what am I going to name you? You look like... Uh, what, you're, you have like a little sh on top of your head. I'm going to name you Dollop. I'm going to be named Dollop. Ah! No! I didn't get to name you! Do I have to go to like a name renamer or something like that? All I usually do in the morning is uh, just be just be happy to wake up. <laughs> I mean, also a solid choice. A little bit of self-affirmation. Was that on the ground? Oh, it's just flowers. That's cool. Spend the first hour of waking up in agony. <laughs> Just for, just for, uh, just for good measure. How do I, uh, find... Oh, there you are. Hey, Palmy. Um, I would love to... <gasps> Yo, small panda bean! Wait. I'm <gasps> sick as FATM, but happy four months of woo. Oh my gosh. Th thank you for the four months of support. I'm so sorry that you're feeling, uh, feeling crappy, though. I hope you feel better soon. Get some rest, right? Oh, man, I can't actually rename you, can I? Oh, yeah, change nickname. There we go. Hold on. You're going to be Dollop. Whoops. Dollop. Because his, his his head reminds me of like a little dollop of sour cream. Okay, cool. I no longer have to sneak. What is that? Is that a scatterbug? Really? All right, I'll get it, but I don't, I don't really like scatterbugs that much. <laughs> Must leave for work. Have an amazing rest of the journey. Oh my gosh, Scotty, thank you for dropping by and have a wonderful day at work. I hope it goes quick and easy for you. Dollop of Daisy. Yup. Classic Dollop of Daisy. I'm gonna bite you. Chives is a classic, classic bitey lad. Wait, is Chives? I, I didn't actually check Chives' gender. Okay, Chives is a lad. Okay, cool. I'm bald! Ah, oh, frick, you're right. You know what? You got me. You got me good. Yeah. Yeah, it's true. It's true. I can't deny it. I got balds real good. Okay, I don't like Scatterbug. Scatterbug is kind of like big meh energy, um, but I do gotta give him a name. You get to be, um... This Pokemon registers poisonous I'm powder. I'm doing and I like my little kisses on my antlers, woo -hoo. Ooh. Oh, dude, love those little kisses. <laughs> I love the whittle kisses on my whittle antlers. Thank you so much, Small. <laughs> you wonderful being you. This Pokemon scatters poisonous powder to repel enemies. It'll eat different plants depending on where it lives. Okay, so it's a it's a it's a gourmand bug. He leaves. Oh hell yeah. Um, uh, one of one of our uh, one of our friends, uh, King Panda, sent us this song the other day that had ukulele on it, posted in the back channel, and I just absolutely loved the tune of it. I just like immediately started learning it because the artist put the chords in the description. It's it's like one of the first times I picked up my ukulele since I did the uh did the sound redeems for this channel. <laughs> but it was fun. It was a good time. Scatterbug's data has been added to the Pokedex. What is your name gonna be? What is your name gonna be? Um your name is gonna be Um Uh it's gonna be Duffel. Duffel. Congratulations, Duffel. Go to the box and never come back. Uh, send it to a box. Bye. Bye, Duffel. You can keep six Pokemon on your party at once. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. Presumably, I can swap them out, like, on the fly. 